a really tough day as a fire claims the life of a construction worker. Good evening, I'm Carrie Sharp. Rory is off tonight. It happened inside of a charter school here in Nashville where kids were busy learning. New Channel 5's Araceli Crescencio talked with fire officials about what happened. Devastation and heartbreak are often felt after a fire, and at Liberty Collegiate Academy, those emotions were certainly present. Unfortunately, we are reporting a fatality as a result of the incident that occurred here today. Fire officials say around 11 a.m., crews responded to calls of a fire at the charter school, where a summer camp was taking place. There was heavy smoke coming from the second floor of this building. We later found out that there was a third party company working and doing some type of construction on the second floor area where that fire had started. National Fire says four people were working on the second floor. Three people managed to escape, but a female worker was unable to get out. Our crews went inside to locate that member of that com construction crew who was working inside on the second floor, and they found that person unfortunately face down uh, unresponsive and immediately begin CPR and resuscitation efforts. She was rushed to Vanderbilt University Medical Center and was later pronounced dead. The National Fire Department says there were around 20 students inside on the first floor when the fire started on the second floor. As you can see, most of the windows up there have now been boarded. The victim has not been identified and it remains unclear exactly what kind of work the four person crew was doing. We're collecting the statements on exactly what they were working on and exactly what they were doing at the time that it that the fire started because it's likely going to lead to how the fire started. Several students and teachers were checked out on the scene as a result of heavy smoke in the area. A teacher and a student were taken to the hospital as a precaution, but officials say they're expected to make a full recovery. As for the cause of the fire, several agencies are working together to find an answer. In Nashville, Araceli Crescencio, News Channel 5.